Okay, so on Hayes, today's date is the 10th of January 2023, just come to 3 o'clock uh, on a cold Tuesday afternoon. Right, we're doing a further audio analysis for a piece of um, audio sent in by Penny Weiss of Somerset Paranormal. It's about 11 seconds, just, just under 12 seconds in total. Let's look at this. Uh, whoops. Right, let's see where this takes us. I've not listened to it yet. Um, apparently the suspect voice is four to five seconds, so I would just imagine it would be that one there. Just to see whether you can see me properly, or whether you can see and understand me. I've got a little card that I've just got. In between me talking to four to five seconds. Or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see. Or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see and understand me, or whether you can see and understand me, or whether you can see and understand me, or whether you can see and understand, or whether you can see, or whether you can see, or whether you can see. Or whether you can see me. Or whether you can see me. Or whether you can see. Or whether you can see. Hmm. Um. I've suddenly got interested in that sound. It sounds like a rap. It's quite a bit of um, background noise. Let's just take it off a loop and let's have a listen through. Um, I've not amplified it. No, the bit where it's quite good. Um, they're just going to play a couple of times, just get used to the background sound. Just to see whether you can see me properly, or whether you can see understand me. I've got a little card that I've just got out that's on my knee. It's just to see whether you can see me properly. Or whether you can see and understand me. I've got a little card that I've just got out that's on my knee. It's just to see whether you can see me properly. Um I can't understand, it's just the sheer amount of noise that's going on. Um, um, so, about safe. Okay. What I'm going to do is um, see if I can clean the audio up a little bit. Um, it, I just don't understand why there's so much noise running through it all. Uh, oops. 
Didn't like that for some reason. Right, I'm just going to pause the video until we can find out. Um, ah, right, okay, sorted. It's half out. Um, just to see whether you can see me properly. Or whether you can see and understand me. That's a bit of a sample, because I know that is... Um, that's just noise. Just to see whether you can see me properly, or whether you can see... Um, yeah, that'll do me. Spelling there. Just to see whether you can see me, probably. Yeah, you can see instantly. It's uh, it's cleaned it up now. Um, that adversely affected the track. This is obviously the cleaned up version, or on top being um, the original one. So, I mean, you can see it's cleaned up considerably, as well as the rest of it. Um, right, okay. Um, let's make that a wee bit smaller. I'm going to mute that's that one. I'm going to concentrate on the cleaned up version. Just to see whether you can see me properly, or whether you can see and understand me. I've got a little card that I've just got. I hope that's on my knee. Just to see whether you can see me properly, or whether you can see and understand me. Yeah, uh, now I can hear it. Uh, that's not a rap. I've heard hundreds of them. Um, yeah, I just don't know what it is. Um, so with no amplification at all. Yeah, okay. I'll forget about that one. Uh, just wanted to have a look at my own interest in that one. So we're talking four to five seconds. That's what. Uh, four to five seconds. see and see 
and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see and see whether you can 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 see just to see whether you can see me properly whether you can see just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly just to see whether you can see me properly or whether you can see understand me just understand me 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 understand okay um I'm pretty confident they they're in some sort of hollow building. Something's reflecting the sound. The reasons this is all this by high end byproduct there. That is the voice. It's the fundamental principle of the voice, which fits in perfectly with a female talking. So um, I'm going to presume that is um, that is in fact Penny talking. Um, I'm going to get rid of these frequencies to see if it does have any effect on the voice itself. So it'll just take me a couple of minutes to, to do that. Understand me? 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 Understand me, 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 understand me. Okay, two back to normal volume. All I've actually done is to remove the, the high end because if, you, if you're talking, such as with a bassy voice, um, close to the recorder, the sounds bounce off walls and you get this natural reverberation and you get this high-end reflections of sound coming off walls, ceilings, furniture, any sort of hard surface and it makes the sound sound thinny. Uh, often going into the cathedral you get this very deep view and if it's loud enough you'll all, often get an echo of the full sound uh, repeating its belt back after you. <clears throat> so in some some um, churches and uh, larger churches and cathedrals, if you said hello, for example, you did hello, hello, the second one be repeat. In this case, I'm pretty confident. I don't know if she actually says it in the email. It's in some sort of hollow building. Uh, ah, church porch. Right. Okay, that'll explain it. Um, if there's any, any open, no door, you know, for example, some of the, you can just walk simply and there's no door to isolate. That could also explain the reason why there's quite a bit of, of background noise going on there. Um, right, okay. Um, let's get back into this. So I'm going to presume... I've got no volume on that at all. That that 
is Penny's voice. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to save this as uh, so I've got that. So if Penny's around that area, I know she's she's better get that area before goes back again I've got a general idea of what a voice actually sounds like so I've got the frequency for that so I'm going to take um and if I just switch if I switch the EQ off you'll start to hear I guess it just thins it out and also done is just remove the frequencies which uh, don't affect the human side. Right, okay, so what I'm going to do now is... So we've got Penny's voice there. So we're going to come back now to four to five seconds, and I think this has to be the area that that, that Penny refers to. Look at that a second. Yeah, um, similar volume as well. Um, see the, the volumes is quite similar. Yeah, so that indicates if it, um, Penny was in the the second average of that. So if that's four to five seconds, she must be referring to that there.
Last to chat with Penny Thirsty before it. Uh, she didn't know what that is, so that's fine, we can ignore that. So this Whether you can see, 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 whether you can see. There's a. Ah, oh, oh. There's running parallel to the voice. Um, let's take the EQ off to see if we can hear it any better. Um, I have amplified this. God, you've got to listen carefully. There is something going on in between. I was presuming it was after Penny's book, but it's actually while she's talking. Whether you can see, whether you can see. Yeah, it's whether just you after. Can see, whether you can see, whether you can see, whether you can see. That's a completely different sound. That bit before it is definitely Penny talking. It's the same frequency as the one earlier. Really difficult to hear without the EQ change. That's strange, I put the EQ on, I've actually taken frequencies out. It's clear. I take the EQ off, <coughs> so there's no EQ affection effect at all. Ah, of course, of course, yeah, because the volume's down. Right, okay, fooled myself there. I've saved this one, haven't I? Yeah, yeah, so let's go flat. Now whack it up. I thought that was uh, strange. Tell me, tell me, tell me. Yeah, definitely EPP. Uh, 
right within the um, the device frequency afterwards. Um, let's see if I can get a fix on the frequency, and I might be able to take out Penny's voice if it's not in the same one. <laughs> Yeah, as you can see here, the, the frequency is still within. Um, this is Penny's voice, you see. Starts at about 150, moves up, big pillar of sound down to around 300. This one, again, about 160, maybe. Not as loud. In fact, it's about. What's that? Minus 48. So Penny's talking. So there are two, two things with this. EVP generally, electronic device phenomena, work on the same frequency. Uh, so very diff difficult at times to distinguish if it's um, disembodied or is it an EVP. I think with what we can say is it's not Penny's voice because it's down on volume anyway and there are subtle differences you know it's a much thicker uh, mountain where this is more like a chimney stack of Penny's voice so the it is different particularly because Penny's talking you've got that volume and the one that is immediately after is about a quarter of its volume Penny said she also picked up the anomaly um, on a separate video camera. Uh, I've dealt with, with a case in Jamaica in recently where they had about three cameras. Uh, it'd be interesting to see what that could uncover. So what we need to do now is what I can say is it's not Penny's voice. I can back that up with a frequency. Um, we know the area of interest and the problem is you've got voices before and after so it can sometimes be problematic to just grab that area but so what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to time stretch so for example if this is at 120 beats per minute I'm going to go for a much slower tempo so slow the voice down, grab that area, then speed it back up again. Uh, I think that's the best way to deal with this one. So I'm gonna, actually going to go to 700. So it's about 70% slower. Um, that's the tap. I think we're there. Look at the frequency. Yeah, I'm going to have to do this in stages and um, let's go back to where it was. Is it that bit there? It is, isn't it? So, that area there. That area there.
Okay, I should now be able to just grab that area. Um, That should now be the same. Typical of um, an EVP, very, very fast tempo, very quick. Um, let's see what that gives us. <laughs> Well, I've slowed that by maybe general default of um, 50% slower. Um, it generally works. So, oops, look at that. I'm just going to repeat this a number of times. See if we can make any sense out of this. Um, can't tell what is being said to be honest um we'll get rid of um that particular one um because i'm really not sure of the the tempo of this it still sounds um Fast. <laughs> 
I'm pretty confident that speech tempo. Uh, he's right. I'm, I'm pretty confident with the tempo. Um. I'll be interested to see what Penny thinks of that. Um. I'm going to wonder if this is a foreign accent um, or maybe even Latin. Um, it's almost seems to have got an accent with it as well. Um, what I'm going to do it's going to be a long video, this one. Um, <coughs> I'm going to see if I can... It sounds quite clear. Um, there is a little bit of um, frequency with it. I'm just going to try a um, another clean up on this particular file. Um, let's just see what that sounds like. Yeah, I'm going to go there. I'm going to apply a different um, method of. Um... This is to see whether you can see me properly or whether you can see, um, understand me. I've got a little card that I've just got, I hope that's on my knee. Okay, that well, software's gone a bit buggy for me today. Okay. This may or may not work. It's um Could the actual file itself now is it's fairly fairly well cleaned up. Um, Just slightly quick tempo. Um, we'll call this uh, V2. Um, 
We'll drag that back in there. Do I'll do a separate track for this? Um, One of those complex bitty audio files it I think the trouble is if I if this is is it like a foreign voice because it's quite clean so it should actually be clearer but I can't make the tell of what's being said. Um right, I need to bring in the same EQ Yeah. Yeah. I've just degraded it. I've just I've taken too much uh, frequency out. <coughs> Maybe because there's no noise there. Excuse <coughs> me. So what I'll do is I'll save these sample files. Um, I can't do any more with these. The only thing that's letting this down is its volume. Um, I'll actually take a frequency of that. Uh, I think it can specify it as an EVP mainly because it's not Penny's voice based on low volume and the way it sounds and the key giveaway with EVP is its tempo generally with some of them come out very very quickly uh, and it is about 50% faster than what it should be in the human spectrum so I'm confident with that and what we'll call this is uh, uh, EVP for Penny. So I'll just say that so we've got like a visual thing. Um, what I need to do now, just because if you look at those two files. You've got to bear in mind that Penny's voice is muted before it. Right, that's Penny's voice. Very distinct chimney of frequency running from about 155 hertz to around 300. Very clear and precise. The volume is important, mine is 27, and, and Penny's holding the recorder. So as she continues to talk, the voice volume will be the same, and the frequency with it. But it's not, it's clearly much lower. At around 170, 180 hertz to about 250. This is the reflection, nothing to do with that. And the volume is minus 54, so clearly the voices are, are different. Um, I have got some um, EQ on there, but they've been applied to both samples. So... <coughs> right. Turn that up. I 
I think I might have actually just saved it. I can't remember now. I'll do it again. If you can save. Oops. Okay. <laughs> That k k that's Penny just stopping talking. We've got the tail end of that. Very difficult to do anything with that. And uh, the rest of it is the EVP. So fairly clear. It's um, you'd almost give that an A, but I think I'd give that probably a, a C plus, mainly because the volume isn't high. You've actually got a volume, a turn the volume up. Um, and the fact we can't hear what is being said, Penny may have a different opinion on that. Maybe a foreign voice line, that type of stuff. So I'll get that off to Penny and um, see what our thoughts are. Okay, see you soon. Bye.